and still on security, Borno State Governor Baba Ganazulum has said the whereabouts of no fewer than 10% of Borno's residents are unknown due to the activities of insurgents in the northeastern state. Zulum said this during his visit to President Muhammad Buhari to brief him about the security situation in the state. The president also hosted Plateau State Governor Simon Lalong, who gave him updates on the situation in Plateau. Our correspondent Abisola Adebayo has details in this next report. The security situation in Bono State has made Governor Babangana Zulum a regular visitor at the presidential villa. His last visit was in July, and this time he has come to brief President Mohamed Buhari on the latest development, particularly the surrendering of some Boko Haram fighters in the state. While many Nigerians have expressed doubt over the terrorist repentance, Zulum says considering the impact of the conflict, the surrendering is a welcome development. This is a very serious matter and I think the report of the surrendering of the insurgents to me in particular and to the greater people of Borno State is a very welcome development. Unless we want to continue with an endless war, I see no reason why we shall reject those that are willing to surrender. The governor also said it will seek further interventions from relevant stakeholders within and outside the country. Among those that have surrendered, some are innocent that are possibly inscripted into this program. Some are teenagers below the age of 11, 12, but they can handle AK-47. And there is one very important thing that Nigerians need to understand. If this issue of the Boko Haram insurgency is not, has not, is not resolved, I believe it will never end because it is a generation. After Austin Zulum, President Buhari also received the Plateau State Governor Simon Lalong, who gave an update on the recent attacks and the general security situation in the state. We've done a lot. And like I said, I've addressed as a governor, I've addressed the Basa issue. I've met with the Fulani community, community, I've met with the Rigue community, and all of them had gone back to where we stopped before, on agreements to live in peace. On the side of the, of the killings, uh, we, we rescued about 26 people, and uh, those of them that were also uh, given proper attention, we addressed them at the hospitals, and when we saw a lot of them recovered, I let I, my deputy governor led the team in taking them to Ondo. At his last meeting with the service chiefs, President Buhari says he is ready to reject the security architecture if it becomes necessary in order to achieve the desired result. Abisola Adibayo, TV360, Lagos.